and happy Thanksgiving. I'm Kristen Hartman. New in the last hour, the power is back on in the West End after hundreds of people spent nearly 24 hours in the dark. Duke Energy tells us it took hours just to find the problem, let alone fix it. Nine on your sides, Whitney Miller spoke with residents who say the outage hurt their holiday plans. And I'm ready to get out of here because it's freezing in my home. Ebene Galt and several residents who live in the Parktown community in the West End say this year's Thanksgiving was ruined. We were having Thanksgiving dinner down here, but, um, but fortunately we have someone else that is willing to host. Galt, like many of her neighbors, spent Thanksgiving Day in the dark. Yeah, it happened too often, man. It takes too long for it to come back on. Since around 6 p.m. Wednesday, Duke Energy says crews have been trying to pinpoint the problem, finally realizing on Thanksgiving Day that it was a faulty underground power line. This is the third time this year that this has happened, and there's always a delay with the repairs, but there's never a delay with the bills. Michael Brown says on top of Thanksgiving dinner being ruined for him and his neighbors, he's worried about the elderly. A lot of elderly, you know, uh, it's ridiculous. It doesn't make sense for this to continue happening. In a statement to WCPO, Duke Energy says it's so unfortunate that it's a holiday and we are working very hard to fix it as soon as possible. Even with the hope it will soon be restored, Brown says he can't help but to feel singled out. And it's always seen like this complex. You can look over at Richmond Village, they have electric, it's always part time. In Cincinnati, Whitney Miller, 9 on your side.